Good morning and welcome back everyone. Today, I'm with Brittany, a great friend of mine and ex-girlfriend. <laughs> and I think she'll have an interesting perspective on some of these questions. And I hope that this will inspire you to be more thoughtful throughout your day. And I would really like for you to answer these questions in the comment section below. This is part of my philosophical challenge. It's for the month of January to release one video every day for the entire month. And I think it's fun. So if you haven't yet, please hit that subscribe button and join me all throughout the month of January. And from then on, on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. For Monday, I have Manliness Monday, which is about beard care, uh, style, and etiquette, and just good advice for men. Good, just good life advice. On Wednesdays, I will release a new philosophical video, and on Fridays, I will release a project video, which I do everything from making bottle stoppers to furniture, even the camera stand that I'm shooting this on now. So if you haven't, hit that subscribe button and join me. What would a utopia be like? How would it function and continue to exist? See, I used to really like the idea of utopias. I think we even talked about this once in the past. Self-sufficient. We wouldn't have to rely on other places and countries for things like money and food. We wouldn't even need money. Like, in my opinion and stuff, I think that currency is like a bad thing. Well, I think, well, all right. I think currency is necessary. I don't think it's bad. It's people I think that are bad. the way, yeah, in which we use our currency is a bad thing. But in a utopia type environment, mm -hmm. I don't think that there would be like need for currency. Um, how would it function and continue to exist? See, how would it continue to exist? I mean, you're always gonna have like that one dickhead that's gonna own everything. Well, yeah, the only reason communism doesn't work is people are people. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> See, I, I say this all the time. People think I'm, like, insane. Communism isn't a bad thing. Like, on paper, it's... I'm gonna, like, I'm gonna, like go to jail. Bald eagles are, like, gonna swoop down on me any second now. <laughs> like, written down is not a bad thing. So, I guess my utopia would <laughs> technically be some form of communism. But, you know, with a bunch of nudists running around and people feeding each other grapes. <laughs> that sounds like a pretty See, when good I place. I think of like Utopia, I think of like an ancient Greek painting for some reason. Uh, why not? I think a Utopia would well, pretty much be like that. It would be something Star Trek-esque where we could explore the galaxy. We wouldn't have to worry about food. Really want. We would just have to figure out what we wanted to do with our lives and do that it's impossible because scarcity exists everything is scarce resources time it, it's all finite and because of that everyone can't have everything they want a utopia can't exist because people are people there's the further you remove people from each other the less they care about each other's problems and they only care about people in their circle and I think that's a big problem with the world in general is the level of care people have versus the distance to problems. In a utopia, you wouldn't have to worry about that. But people are people. They will be lazy and not put in their fair share. In my utopia, there wouldn't be hunger or disease or war. There wouldn't be famine. Um, you, you would choose what you wanted to do and do it. How would it function? I don't know, I guess like Star Trek. That's as close as you can get to a ideal society. I like how you're going in the future and I'm going back in the past. <laughs> well, different ideas. Yeah. Thanks for watching guys, I really appreciate it. And like I said, if there's anything that you, if you have any responses to these questions, please let me know in the comment section below. I would really enjoy hearing what you guys think. This might just be a cool little experiment, but I'm having a lot of fun with it, and I'm getting to, to have a, a good discourse with a, a variety of different people. So throughout the day, try and ask this question to somebody else. See what somebody else's opinion are. It may just change what you think about things yourself. Thanks again for watching, guys, and I really appreciate it. Please hit that subscribe button, and if you like this, please like that hit that like button too. It really does help this channel out a lot. 
Uh, and don't forget, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. It's kind of cool that things are starting to get along and, and, and improve. And I think this is a cool little community that we're building together. And I'd like this to continue. Don't be a stranger. And remember, stay thoughtful. See you next time.